Welcome to Drupal Land. Today we're going to see how to install MetaTag modules on a Drupal 10 installation. So let's go ahead and get started. Let's fire up the terminal. Let's go to our directory and then let's log into the website first. And uh, I'm using Lando, fixing it. So Lando Composer Repair Drupal Smash Match Tag. Let's go ahead and search this in Google. Match Tag Drupal. Click on it. And then let's go into the terminal. Yeah, as you can see, it is installed the latest version 1.22. It's also go here and as you can see 1.22 is the installation now if you need how to you know further proceed with this let's go ahead with the readme documentation as you can see scroll down the readme so it basically gives all the details how to install this and how to make use of this now let's go ahead and uh, install the meta tags Let's look for meta tags. As you can see, now let's just install meta tags. There's a lot of options available here. Let's just install for now the meta tag core one. Let's enable this. As I've installed the translations on this instance, it is just updating the translations uh, at, under a normal vanilla installation installation this shouldn't be happening yeah as you can see the module meta tag has been enabled so let's also go ahead and search the meta tag enable this let's get to configure and as you can see it provides comes with the default configuration and settings uh, now let's choose content so for any contents throughout the site as it in that's global the title will be taken from no title, site name, description will be summary and the canonical URL will be URL. Now let's try to change this for a particular content type if needed be. As you can see here in the entity type, in the content article, you can enable this so that you will get the necessary tags let's click on this add default meta tags here you can choose the content type article in the basic tags you can make use of the token just click on let's put the page title as just the note title not even the current page title yeah let's click on this checkbox current page title and the description it needs to put the note related article or things but let's just stick with this in the page title we just put current page title and also the current maybe the site world let's just put the site name so the page title will be current page title and our site name now let's close this let's save this let's look for the site name it has a dress site install we'll just replace this perhaps with Drupal run save this 
let's go ahead and add a content to article now let's put this uh, sample content for magic now let's just save this and now we will just inspect the DOM and let's go for the head and see the meta where we need to look for the title as you can see the meta title will be we can also use the page source in the page source you can see the title is sample content for meta type which is the actual title for the node or drupal lan or drupal lan is the name of the site so we have seen how to install the basic version of a meta tag and update the meta tag for a single content type in this case article we will deal with uh, using multiple fields and others for the tokens in the following tutorial thank you guys